And along with those flying in, over a half million students will be on break from local schools right here in the Bay Area, and it could end up being the biggest spring break ever. Yeah, with that being said, safety will be a big priority for all the people packing the beaches. ABC Action News reporter Sarah Hollenbeck has been speaking with law enforcement on how they're upping their patrols for the busy few weeks ahead. The sun, the sand, the surf, the fun. Come on, Mandy. <laughs> spring break is Florida's peak time, and keeping these thousands of people safe is a tall task. I think it's going to be extremely busy. On a typical day, 7 to 12 officers would patrol the sand on Clearwater Beach. This spring break, they'll have up to 30 officers at a time cruising along the shoreline. Alcohol is their biggest focus. Much like tailgating at a a football game, they'll have coolers in their car, and that's something that the bicycle team and the traffic enforcement team will be looking for, and we have an absolute zero tolerance for that. An open container could cost you 118 bucks. Clearwater Beach is family friendly, and officers plan to keep it that way. It's not just the officers patrolling in four wheelers, but also the lifeguards going up and down the sand, making sure that people in the water are safe as well. Lifeguards will also beef up staff at the seven lifeguard towers on Clearwater Beach. One of the biggest things we deal with out here is missing kids. Uh, parents need to know that a good idea is to take a photo that morning of your kids. So we have a accurate photo and an accurate description uh, of the child. And that's even more important this year with record breaking crowds expected wherever you venture. Here in Tampa Bay, more than 99,000 college and university students are off next week. Plus, more than 542,000 K through 12 students. That makes for well over half a million students on spring break at the same time. And that doesn't even factor in out of town visitors. We are expecting to be crushed. We're expecting all the schools are coming down, spring training. Uh, I think it'll be the best spring break down here in a long, long time. Businesses are stocked and ready. Law enforcement in Sarasota and Manatee County are increasing the number of their officers on the shoreline, too as both school districts are also off next week. And while safety will be a top priority, fun is a close second. We hand out things like um, Frisbees to kids and drive around on the mules and high five kids and, and make sure that everybody does have that very welcomed experience here so that they want to come back. On Clearwater Beach, Sarah Hollenbeck, ABC Action News.